Hey guys, welcome to the second video of this coordinate geometry video. In this video, we are going to talk about a point dividing the length in ratios. So, what do I mean? So, first consider one point na consider martin. Generic point x1, y1. I have considered a generic point x1, y1. Let's take another generic point that is x2, y2. What I did I do? I have taken x1, y1 as a generic point. I have considered x2, y2 as a generic point. Now, let's say the distance between them is 10 units. Let's say the distance between them is what? 10 units. Now, I will introduce a point x, y in between which is in center. I will introduce x, y another point which is in center between them. First time, the Canada Lona. First time, the x1, y1 on point. The one generic name. In one name down x2, y2 at point. Our error the distance is 10 meter and consider mana. So Nanika in one point na introduce Martini, Yautarandre, e distance of the e distance na samawagi hunchback. So what will be this distance? This will be 5, this distance will be 5, this distance will be what? 5. Isn't it? Now if I take a ratio of these two distances, that is 5 by 5, how much do I get? 1 by 1. So we can say this point, this point is dividing this distance in this distance in 1 is to 1 ratio, isn't it? He gets the itra head boda, e point to e distance, mathe e distance no 1 is to 1 ratio the lead divide mathe than the head boda. Yes, yes, yes. Did you get what I'm talking to tell? What I'm trying to tell, right? Now, there is a formula for finding this, this number if these ratios are given. So, what is that? If x1, y1, and x2, y2 are the ordinates, right? If there are two uh, points, if I have a point, another point, x, y, which is dividing in the ratio m is to n. Some ratio, here I know the distance was 10, that is dividing 5 and 5. Here I don't know the ratio, it may divide 1 is to 2, 2 is to 3, 3 is to 4. It can divide in any ratio, right? I'll consider it as m is to n ratio. How to find x and y is a question. See here, how to find it? See, this is a formula for internal uh, dividing the decos because this, this point is in between them. If this point is outside, there's another formula, we'll see that. First, which is dividing the uh, ratio internally, which is dividing the distance ratio internally, okay? How to do it? See here, you have to find x. To find x, take opposite number and here, n into x1, n into x1 plus this into this, m into x2 divided by this plus this that is m plus n in the same way if i consider another uh, y axis so if i consider the y uh, coordinate what will happen so y is equal to n into y1 the same thing n into y1 this into this number plus this into this number that is m into y2 divided by n plus m you have to remember this formula if without this formula you can't do anything Let's take an example. Let's take an example. Let's take there is let's say this is 3 comma 2 and this is 4 comma 7. Okay. It is dividing. There is a point x comma y. We have to find that which is dividing the distance in ratio 1 is to 2. Did you get the question? Yes. What is the question? The distance here, I don't know. There will be some distance, right? The distance is divided in the ratio 1 is to 2. Find the x and y. What is this point? What is this point we have to find? How to find it? See here. How to find it? See here. I need to find x. So what to do? Catch 2. 2 into 3. Because x, if you want to find x, only take consider x coordinate. 2 into 3. 2 into 3 plus. Next here also go. 1 into 4. 1 into 4. Divided by this plus this. That is 1 plus 2. So if I calculate, I will get x. What will be x? 3 2 is 6 plus 4 is 4 divided by 3. In the same way, if I want to calculate y, again the same thing. So, this into this, that is 2 into 2. This number into this number plus this number into this number, that is 1 into 7 divided by this plus this, that is 1 plus 2. So, y is equal to what? 2 into 2, 4 plus 7 divided by 3, that is 11 by 3. So, this is 10 by 
3, this is 11 by 3. So I can write x and y ordinate as or the uh, point as 10 by 3 comma 11 by 7. Is that good? Is that good? Is that good? We'll write the uh, formula again. We'll do, we'll do one or two questions on it again. Then we'll move on. Okay. What is the question now? See here, there are four questions. Let's solve all of them. There are two points given. One point and one point. It is dividing in three into four ratio internally. So let's solve this. There are two points. Let's say this is one point that is one comma two and three comma four. Let's say these are the two points. Now there is another point which is x comma y. We have to find this. It is dividing in what and what ratio? Three and four. How to find? Very simple. This into this, this into this, divided by this plus this. Okay. For x, what you need to do? For x, only consider x number. So four into one. 1 into 4, this into this, plus, for again here we only consider only x, 3 into 3, that is 3 times 3 divided by 3 plus 4. In the same way, if I want to consider y, what will be y number? 4 into this, 4 into 2, y, y means we have to take, if you consider y axis or y coordinate, you have to take only y numbers. So, 4 into 2 plus 3 into 4, 3 into 4 divided by this plus this, 3 plus if you calculate this, you will get an answer. Let's go to the next question. 3 comma, 3 comma 2 and minus 1 comma 7, right? It is, there are two points. It is dividing in the ratio 1 is to 2, 1 is to 2, internally, again internally. So what do you do? Again, for x, we have to consider only x, 2 into 3, 2 into 3, 2 into 3, plus uh, 1 into minus 1, 1 into minus 1 divided by this plus this that is 1 plus 2 again what do, what do we have again here for y we have to consider only what y ordinate that is 2 into 2 2 times 2 plus again 1 times 7 1 times 7 this plus this that is 1 plus 2 let's last all the final question what is the final question here again there are two points that is one is 4 comma 5 another one is minus 2 comma 4 comma 5 and minus 2 comma 3. There are two coordinates now. So now there, are, there is another point which is dividing in what? 1 is to 3 ratio. 1 is to 3 ratio. So how to solve this? So we have to find x. To find x, we have to only consider x parameters. So 3 into 4. 3 into 4. 3 into 4 plus 1 into minus 2 divided by this plus this. 1 plus in the same way, if you want to take consider y, what do you have to take? Only y number, that is 3 into 5. 3 times 5 plus 1 into 3. 1 into 3 divided by this plus this. This plus this. Okay, if you solve this, you will get an answer. Yes, this is the first question answer, second and third. It is very important question. I think this is asked many times. So we should be capable of solving it very easily. The last question is externally. They are asking you to find this is which is dividing externally. We will see one of the question. Okay. We will we'll, I'll teach you how to do this. Okay. So let's go to the next frame. Okay. Let's move to the last question. What is given? So 4 comma 3 is there. And there is another number. That is another point. That is 7 comma 8. What they are telling? There is another point. There is another point x comma y which is external here all there were in between now it will be external to this or to this there can be a uh, this this x comma y can be here or here but it is not in between these two points that is the meaning of external that is dividing in ratio 1 is to 2 okay so how to solve this everything remains so I can just take this as negative okay the formula x is equal to first start with m what is m this is this into this that is 1 into 7 and minus minus 2 into 4 divided by this minus this plus this right? that is 1 minus 2 this plus this means 1 plus of minus 2 that becomes 1 minus 2 and also for y what will be y for the y what i have to consider the same thing 1 into 8 that is 1 times 8 minus 2 times 3 minus 2 times 3 1 minus Right? Simple. That is a symbol. If they give externally, just we have to take this as negative. And you have to start with this. This number into this number. And this number into this number. Divided by this plus this. Okay? We will take your question paper question. And move to the next topic. Okay? 
Okay, this is one of the examination question that has appeared. See what is given? The coordinates of the point. We have to find the coordinates of the point which divides the line joining this and this. The ratio 2 comma 3. What they are asking to do? There are two points that is 8 comma 3 and minus 5 comma 6. We have to find a coordinate x comma y which is external. Why did I write here? Not here because they are mentioned externally. In the ratio 2 is to 3. That is this is 2. This is 3. Right? So if they given externally what you have to consider? We have to think that this as negative. So what to do? 2 into this number that is 2 times minus 5. 2 into minus 5. And what will happen? 2 into minus 5 minus 3 into 8 minus 3 into 8 divided by this plus this that becomes 2 plus minus 3 that will become minus 3. 2 minus 3. This is an x ordinate and let's take y coordinate. What will be the y value? Again this into no start from 2 the positive number. This into this that is 2 times 6. 2 times 6 minus this into this number that is 3 times 3 divided by this plus this that is 2 minus so how much do I get? X is equal to minus 10 minus 24 over minus 1 comma here y will become what? 6 2 is a 12 minus 9 divided by minus 1. So 3 by minus 1 that is equal to minus 3 and here this will become minus 25 by minus 1 that is minus 25 upon minus 1 that is equal to 25. What is the final option? The x comma 1 that which we have to find the x comma 5 which we have to find that is 25 comma minus 3 is that good yes you can do this there is no no there is no problem just le let me explain in Kannada once no really externally kutra kutra ratio na negative togo beko amal one number it koli pa one number it koli two first it koli x ke lera bari x sigma multiply beko two into minus five two into minus five amal minus three into eight minus three into eight divided by idu plus idu two plus minus three na two minus three alva 2 plus of minus 3 and 2 minus 3 and alva. Adetara, why you might be can read more? Same other trade code number 2 into y, but you why you want 2 into 6, 2 into 6. Amala minus 3 into 3, minus 3 into 3 divided by this plus this, that is 2 plus of minus 3, that becomes 2 minus 3. So solve matter with either. Okay, let's go to another question that I've asked in the exam. We'll just do that and go to the next topic. Hey, let's get into the next question. The coordinate of a point which divides the line joining of the points, this and this, in the ratio 2 into 3, 2 is to 3 internally. What they are asking you, we have to find the coordinate of a point. We have to find the coordinate of a point, let is x comma y, which is divides the line joining. Which are the points? One point is a plus b comma a minus b. This point and this point, that is a minus b comma a plus b. See? This point is dividing these two points in the ratio 2 is to 3 internally. Internally means we have to write it in between. If it is externally, we have to write it outside. That's it. So we know the formula. So this into this plus this into this divided by this plus this. So let's start with this. 2 into. So x coordinate will be 2 into a minus b. This into this. That is 2 into a minus b. Is that correct? Plus this into this. That is 3 times a plus b divided by this plus this that is 2 plus 3 in the same way if i take y ordinate what will happen so again 2 into y ordinate that is 2 times a plus b in the same way plus 3 times the y ordinate that is 3 times a minus b divided by this plus this that is 2 plus 3 so let's get this so x is equal to 2a minus 2b 2a minus 2b plus 3a plus 3b divided by 2 plus 3 is how much? 5. So how much do I get? 2a plus 3a. How much is that? 5a. 5a. 2a plus 3a is how much? 5a. Minus 2b plus 3b how much? 1b divided by how much is it? 5. In the same way, let's calculate the y. Right? 2a plus 2b plus 3a minus 3b divided by 2 plus 3 is how much? 5. So y will be equal to what? 2a plus 3a is 5a plus 2b minus 3b is how much? Minus b divided by 5. So the points which we are searching that is x comma y are nothing but this comma this that is 5a plus 1b divided by 5 comma 
फाइव ए माइनस बी डिवाइडेड बाई फाइव दीज आर दी टू पॉइंट इज दैट गुड आर यू एबल टू फॉलो यस लेट्स गो टू द नेक्स्ट टॉपिक विच इज डिवाइडिंग एक्सिस इन सम रेशियो लेट्स डू दैट ओके चलो लिजन इफ आई टेक y and x axis let's consider a straight line where this point is x1 comma y1 this point is x2 comma y2 ee distance o 10 anta thagondre ee distance na 10 anta thagondre ee x axis alli one point yen maartide ee distance matte ee distance na split maartide alva ee distance matte ee distance na स्प्लीट मार्ट ई डिस्टेंस बाय ई डिस्टेंस ई डिस्टेंस बाय ई डिस्टेंस ई डिस्टेंस बाय ई डिस्टेंस ये स्थिरता है अंदर है माइनस वाई वन एंड वाई टू सो दिस डिस्टेंस बाय दिस डिस्टेंस इस माइनस वाई वन इस टू वाई टू और माइनस वाई वन बाय वाई टू यू हैव टू रिमेम्बर दिस सी इन्हें इधर वन स्ट्रेट लाइन इधर है और पॉइंट्स इन्हें एक्स वन वाई वन इलेन इधर एक्स टू वाई टू आ स्ट्रेट लाइन ना ये मार्ट इधर है ये लाइन को डिवाइड मार्ट इधर है डिवाइड मार्ट अगर यार डिस्टेंस क्रिएट आये तो इलोन डिस्टेंस क्रिएट आये तो इलोन डिस्टेंस क्रिएट ये डिस्टेंस हो ये डिस्टेंस ये डिस्टेंस बाय ये डिस्टेंस ये सेम वे इफ आई कंसीडर x1 y1 एंड x2 y2 ये क्या लगता है y एक्सिस हो ये रेशियो मतलब ये टोटल डिस्टेंस ना ये रेशियो ये रेशियो के डिवाइड मारती है ना सो आर रेशियो इन बरत है माइनस x1 x2 सो माइनस x1 इस टू x2 रेशियो ली डिस्टेंस हो डिवाइड आ गया था ओके ना ये वर्ड तो इम्पोर्टेंट हो यू हैव टू रिमेम्बर We'll do one or two questions on this, which have directly appeared. Just you can see and write it. See, I'll I'll directly say they'll give you point two comma three and four comma five. Let's say that's a point. They'll ask you to find what is the ratio where the y-axis is dividing. Which axis? Y-axis is dividing. What is the answer? Minus x one by x two. Minus what is the next one? Two. What is the next two? Four. Minus one by two. This is the answer. That's it. They'll give another question. They'll say four comma five and six comma two. They will ask you. In question, get it there. This the line joining this is divided by x-axis. Is cut by x-axis. What ratio it is dividing? So if it is an x-axis, what should be minus y1 by y2. So minus what is y1? 5 by 2 minus 5 by 2. Asta. This is a simple. It is a question they asked many times. We'll directly take away from your uh, DC question and we will just do it. See, it's too simple. We have to remember if it is going through x-axis, if it is the x-axis, they will become y. If it is going through x axis, it will go from y. If it is going to y axis, it will be x. Always one by two, one by two, one by two. Here y one by two, x one by two. There will be always negative symbol. Okay. How it has come? That is a different story. We will discuss in another time. Okay. See here minus. If we cut to x axis, y one by y two. If it is goes y axis, it will become x one by x two. We will take an example and do some question on it. Okay. Chal. What is the question given? The ratio of the line joining this and this. What they are saying? There is two points, two comma three. Let's say this is two comma three, and let's say that is minus five comma six. The line joining this is intercepted with y-axis. Is intercepted with y-axis. What is this distance to this distance ratio? That's what they are asking. We know for y-axis we have to consider what? For y-axis, for y-axis we have to consider what? X term. So minus x one by x two is the Formula which is x1, which is x2. The smaller is x1, the bigger is x2. So minus 2 upon minus 5. So minus 2 upon minus 5 is what? 2 by 5. Is that good? Yes. You are capable of solving this. Yes or no? Yes. Hey guys, if you like the way that we teach, please do like this video and also share this video with your friends. And don't forget to comment your doubts in the comment section so that we can answer you there itself, or we'll make an entire video explaining the doubt. And do not forget to check our entire video course. The link is in the description. Thanks for watching, guys. All the best.